What up guys? It's Grace the Roof XX here. Today since I don't see that many people asking this question but the best way to farm tickets. I did a video in the past but eh, I don't really think no one watched it. I'm gonna be showing the other way after nine months later. It's simple, really. It's, it's really simple. Wow, is that number even legal down there? I don't think it is. Anyways. It's simple. Alright. Warning. Pretty sure you're writing the title. If you have a condition of being very lazy then this might not be the thing for you anyway we're gonna show the best way to farm ticket now this would be better if you have a 10 10 boost two matching classes for example mines Z Mac or Captain C Captain Combustible and um basically it'll be faster what I'm about to show you right now it'll be faster if you have a ten boost hero. Anyways I'm going to show you that right now. After I uh, beat this game, so I'm probably going to do the magic power of editing my videos. Okay, so, see ya in like a second. Okay. Alright, guys. I'm back. So. So basically, like I said before, you want to um, make sure you have a 10 boost hero, not a 5 boost, as in two matching classes, hero. Well, you could do the 5 boost, but it's going to be a lot slower. And, and like I said before, again, the other video pretty much shows the other way if you don't have the 10 boost hero. You can buy your 10 boost hero if you need with the 750 gems, but I don't know. That it's your choice. If you like, for example, if this is an event rare that you really want, like for example, whenever going viral or Haunted, Pum those Haunted Pumpkin or Bad Moon Rising, those good ones. You're probably gonna want to buy a 10 boost. Try to get 10 boost hero. Try to get four of those as soon as possible, because those are really good. Good few examples. Or if you already have four, you can still do this just for extra sparks. But pretty much what you have to do is simple. You see the boost down there? Four hours. Ain't nobody got time to wait for no three hours. Some people gotta go to bed. Some people gotta, like, like I don't know. Like, there's no way every anybody can play every four hours. There's just no way. And don't even buy the 20 gem fill now. It's just totally not worth it when you do this method I'm about to show y'all. All right. So what you want to do is simple. Go to your settings. Settings. Go to general or whatever. Whatever place you have to check, go to date and time. And if it says automatic date and time, turn that off. And now, it's simple. 
go up four hours. Wait, I don't know how to add. 1 a.m., right? Yes, yeah, 1 a.m. And usually, you change it from one minute. So, if you're kind of impatient like me, it'll make you wait like 50 seconds sometime. Sometimes, but I think I'll just leave it like that for now. We're going to have to change the date. Make sure you change the date because sometimes you're going to have to do that whenever you change it from p.m. to a.m. You don't have to change the date when you, have, when you change it from... AM to PM. So there we go. It's ready. Easy as that. And warning. I know you can do this to see into future daily challenges, but just don't do it. You're gonna, as soon as you put the normal time after you went forward in time to do the daily challenges, it won't let you do them. It's gonna, it's just gonna say at the bottom, not available or unavailable. And then you're just going to have to reinstall your game. <laughs> but like I said. Don't do it. <laughs> oh, and. Let's say. Uh, let's say if you're like. Two hours away. Like for example, you only have like two hours and then like whenever there's a new event rare, for example, like ha down there, like I said, six days and 11 hours. You can just, when it says like two hours or something like that. This is all you have to do if it. This is all you have to do if it says you have two hours left for this to get this event rare. Like it says ends in six days, eleven hours, and if you can't go forward for that hours, do not play the daily challenge. If that's the case, I mean, do not do the um, you know the thing. Do not use any boost this is what you want to do all you simply have to do is go back to the first date that it was released and make sure you change it to after at it doesn't have to be the exact time the event where it started but be somewhere somewhere like that so for example if I was on day, this day right here, and the event rare ends on this day, and I only have like two hours left, I can go back to the original day when it came out, which is this day right here, and, um, and then just get tickets that way and use the 10 boost. So, yeah. pretty simple pretty simple strategy I, mean, I think that's all I have to say yeah pretty much so um yeah So, um, yeah, <laughs> said the same thing twice. Anyways, peace.